Now, for solving this one, first of all, let's understand what a Fibonacci series is. Fibonacci sequence is a sequence in which each number is the sum of the two preceding ones. And by the way, it is not just a classic programming exercise. It is also a great way to explore recursive and iterative techniques in programming. Now let's print the first 10 numbers of the Fibonacci series. All right, to compute Fibonacci series, we write this function called uh, print Fibonacci. Right on top, we initialize uh, two variables a and b, set them to 0 and 1. Uh, these are basically the first two numbers in our uh, Fibonacci series. Then we use a series of uh, if conditions as you can see over here. First of all, we are checking if the input number is less than 1, which means nothing is to be printed. If it is equal to 1 or it is equal to 2, accordingly we print uh, A and uh, A plus B according to the if statements. If the number is more than 2, we print A plus B and for the remaining values, we use a for loop to generate and print the next values in the series. Inside the loop, we calculate the next term, which is C, by adding the previous two numbers, A and B. Then after calculating C, we update the value of A and B according to this. In this place, A takes the value of B and B takes the value of C. We have done this in the first question too, if you could remember, wherein we swapped two numbers. This prepares them for the next iteration of the loop. Now let's uh, run this code. And now let's say we want to uh, print the first 10 numbers of the Fibonacci series. So for that, I'll say 10. And the first 10 numbers have gotten printed. 